Hello everyone. The date today is 2019-03-08, uh, the second Friday of March. And this is going to be weird again because it's been a while again. Uh, but yeah. Uh, what are, oh yeah, circles. Um, I don't have much time because I'm stressed with many projects and finals coming up and all that stuff. So yeah. Uh, I better just draw circles, and it's not drawing my circles. Why not? Because I just got to practice drawing circles, and I'm not going to do the whole that, because that's relaxing. I don't have time to relax. I got to get to sleep right now, because it's literally, what? <laughs> um, I'm going to turn 19. When it turns 19, I'll tell you. It's going to be, come on, come on, come on. But, okay, turn 19 right now, so it's... Uh, 1, 20, 40, 41 minutes till uh, midnight. Yeah. Well, I don't know what I would do if, if it literally just turned 18 and, uh, I don't know. Uh, then, now basically we'd be here at the maximum for a minute. Though I probably would have just said, oh, uh, yeah, that's happening. So what I'm doing right now is just getting used to the circles again, or at least getting used to the drawing pad again, since it's been a while since I've you know, drawn stuff, on digitally at least. So yeah, I'm doing very, I just want, these circles are basically like one stroke circles, just to get ready with the, um, I don't know, stroke, uh, not stroke though, uh, I don't know, what, what do you call this thing? Sketching, before I go into sketching. Sketching mode. So yeah, single uh, single stroke, just doing in this. So, uh, uh, yeah, how's everyone been? I'm stressed, as a lot. I don't know what to do. Four, I have four different projects I'm working on, and coordinating everyone is stupidly hard, because I have to, well, I don't know. Well, it's not stupidly hard because I'm pretty. I hate to say that I'm pretty organized. Eh, it's usually that artists are supposed to be like this, you know. Is it artists or scientists or some? But some people, I don't know. Generally, I'm not an organized person, but wow, have I been organized now? Because I got to be, or else I won't finish anything. <laughs> I mean, last quarter, it was. Fine, like I was organized somewhat, but like I was organized but lazy. Now I'm organized and stressed out. So yeah, there's that. You see, there's a bunch of circles. I know I might be accidentally triggering a triggering tryptophobia or something like that. Like the fear of small holes. Hopefully this doesn't do that because it's just circles, circles upon circles. But maybe it does. It does look kind of like holes. Sorry about that. You may want to skip this, because this is all I'm going to be doing. Just drawing circles. It's boring as frick. Oh wow, that's a pretty good circle. No, don't don't copyright your work. Don't even criticize your work. Remember, you're supposed to be uh, just work. Like it's supposed to be muscle memory. So they have no memory. <laughs> it's, it's making memories. While also doing memories. Also, so so could this be so quickly got smaller for some reason. Like, it was starting large, and then it got smaller. Also, but that—that's the only criticism. Uh, I thought it was more room on the other side. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> um, let's draw more circles. Let's draw the best circle for each size group rating. So this one is a large circle. This one is a well, medium circle. This one becomes smaller. That looks roughly the same size, but whatever. That one gets smaller, you get even more smaller, and you know, ta-da, we've got many circles, or elliptic type shapes, oval type shapes, something of that nature. You know what I just realized? Oh, oh uh, well, I was going to say something, never, never mind. Um, I learned the difference between what an ellipse is and a circle. Well, an ellipse and a oval. And I'm going to do sketching now, so it's more like I'm going to sketch out a circle instead of relying mostly on 
single stroke, so I kind of just sketch it out. That's a circle. Anyway, so um, the difference between an ellipse and an oval is that uh, an ellipse is generally any type of, I don't know, squished thing. Well, a circle, a get the circle. I'm not going to have a formula for a circle. I think it's x squared plus y squared equals it's like n and n being any integer. Or number, actually, any real number, so we can just do r. See, that now that that becomes an ellipse or something, something close to that, or an oval. Right, so. Okay, an oval, uh, okay, an ellipse, based on that formula, is basically like take one of the values and they like, give it a coefficient. Or both. You can do both if you want. Just don't make it so it's like c times x squared and d plus d times y squared equals r squared. Oh, right, I forgot the squared on the first one with the circle. So there's that. Um, the issue, oh uh, no, no, the stipulation is that um, uh, c does not equal d for strict ellipses, I guess. Something like that. I might be totally wrong. I don't know my math that well. <laughs> Actually, when was the last time I used math? Actually, now that I think about it, when was the last time I used math? Uh, don't remember, because the only thing I remember are projects. Projects everywhere. Projects. Must do projects. Okay, oh, and then what's what's an uh, oval? Oval is generally any type of egg shape, so you can have, it's kind of like a, you could, if I, if I had to go through the hierarchy, it would probably be like an oval, um, then comes the ellipse, then comes the circle. So. All ellipses are ovals, and all circles are ellipses. There's just special variants of that. So yeah, I think what I'm drawing is ovals because these feel, they don't, I don't know. Oval is like an egg shape, so it's like, if that closed correctly, that would be an egg shape. But you know how I'll draw an oval. Oh. I actually don't know if that's an oval. I think that might just become a circle. That almost looks like a circle, actually. Darn it. <laughs> I was supposed to draw an oval. Became circle. Oh, man. Okay, let me try that again. Draw an egg-shaped thing. Don't make it into a circle. I think I might be turning this back into a circle again. Why am I so good at drawing circles now? <laughs> I want to draw an oval. You know what? Uh, let me try drawing an ellipse then. Let's see if let's see if my hands they change. I actually don't know if this is okay. This vaguely looks more like an oval than the other ones. This one technically, okay, technically, yes, that is an oval. That is an oval. Yes. Oh, oh. <laughs> I I can't see the cursor well. Hold on. Let me increase the brightness. That helps, kind of. So yeah, there's that. Um, I don't know. We'll do another circle. Got to do a fast sketch, you know? Fast sketch. Fast sketch. Go. So yeah. Oh yeah, I have to ask, how's everyone been? You already know how I've been. Not good, ish. That looks. That, that looks kind of overly. Yeah. Maybe I should just draw small things, because apparently I'm very good at drawing small things. Tiny things. I mean, everyone probably is, because tiny things are very easy to draw. Because they're so small, you don't need that much detail. But once you get zoom in, then, then you need the detail. But then, then it's no longer small. It becomes large. So it's easy for tiny things, because you can get away with the smallness. Okay. What else do I talk about? Um, what am I gonna do? Other stuff? I don't know. Uh, I guess in two weeks, uh, I'm probably gonna come back because I can't do it next week because I got to prepare for finals. Um, so I'm not gonna do any of that. That'll, that'll, that'll require brain energy that I don't want to go to anything else. But yeah, so do that. Uh, and then I don't know what else I'm gonna do. 
So I'm probably going to try finishing up Three Point Perspective. I remember that. I remember doing that. Oh no, I don't remember doing that, so I gotta do that. But I remember that, that that's what I was at. Um, uh, then, I actually don't know what to do after that. I could do like a practice, draw from reference, even, uh, what else? I, I don't fully know what to do. This is the problem with unstructuredness. Because you get no structure whatsoever, and uh, you have to figure out like what you're gonna do. And most people are not good at that. I'm not good at unstructured things. I like the structure, which is probably why I do well in school. But then terrible at life because I have no ability to look at life. Which is probably why I like bookworm and stuff. But I'm not really good at other stuff. I'm also pretty boring when you listen to me. If I got nothing, I can, you can, you got nothing. Got nothing. Unless people are literally laughing at my voice, in which case, uh, okay. Don't mind, but, well, whatever. But actually, not really whatever. I'd probably be like, oh, oh, my voice is funny. Well, that kind of hits my self esteem a bit, but okay, I guess I'll have to live with that. I'm trying to see, like, I don't know. I'm going to try experimenting. What, what other things can I experiment with? Uh, no flux, no flux. Okay, uh, I... and yeah, there we go. So let me try doing that. These, I don't know, progressively built up circles. These are terrible. <laughs> this is not how most people draw circles. And also probably because I'm doing it so heavily. Probably I'm using the wrong pencil, yes. Whatever, I'm gonna make it work. And I'm tired. And other things that things happen with things. Yeah. Woo. Okay. Also, in the back of my mind, I've always been apparently thinking, uh, I gotta finish my projects. Gotta, gotta. Oh, uh, what else? So, what are my projects? One's a website, one's a video. One's uh, an app, one's, and then one's a game, so pretty decent variety of things that I gotta do. And then there's that one class that I don't know why I am so bad at stats. Or at least statistical analysis, I don't, I don't, why, how, what, how do you do this? I'm not actually bad at stats, I'm just, just how, how do you apply this? It's business statistics, if, and for anyone wondering, so it's, Statistics as it applies to business, because you got, I don't know why we have all these different types of statistics, like for every single major we got, like, or something like that, like, basically every single major has statistics, and I gotta take business statistics, well, I don't have to take business statistics, but I'm going to, because for a prerequisite for something else, so, I'll do that, uh, that's the only pro class I don't have a project in, just tests, tests everywhere. I don't even know. Complex statistics. I can totally do it. Uh, like analysis of that statistics. I don't know what to do with this. I actually don't. Actually, no. Probability, I can do. Statistics, I can't. Because probability is theoretical. And statistics is not. Or at least not necessarily statistical. Because I think, I think the way it works is that probability works in the theoretical sense. And it's like describing something. Whereas um, uh, statistics are coming from like a real world. And... That's describing something. So yeah, there's this. Like all these circles. Look at all these circles. We got these ash ones and all that stuff. So uh, let's try doing some shading on like one circle. Yeah, hold on, hold on. I will make. Okay, hold shift and circle. Wow, wow. Look at this. Look at these circles. This is amazing. You can draw circles like me if you if you put your mind to it and work hard. You can draw circles like this, or just be a computer and you know just draw perfect circles all the time. So this one will be the shading part. I'm just filling it up with circles so that I have enough practice on different varieties and stuff. 
Well, the only things you can vary about circles is the size, and I guess I'm doing that. Uh, I don't know, is this enough circles for everyone? I think everybody's sick of seeing circles. These are bubbles, actually. Bubbles. Bubbles that do stuff. So, uh, let's try with my favorite. I think, yeah, the favorite, I guess. Uh, quick shade. Woo. So, one, we have light coming down. So, I will put shadow here. And don't worry about going outside the line. You just have to paint. Not they're actually painting. It's, uh, what is it? What am I actually doing? Shading? Shading? Yeah, shading. Uh, just to get ready for shade. Okay, so I do that. And then I make it a little bit thick. Okay, this one is more... I don't know. I don't know what you'd call this. It's... It's ball. And fully shaded. Uh, let's try one where the center, like you're viewing it from the front, but it gradually gets darker as you go to the edge. So, from the edge, it's darker. Slightly. It's like we're well, doing the front of the ball. Okay. Um, this one, uh, let me try a really dark spot. Let's try an inverse shadow. So, it's like. Yeah, that. It's like a black hole. So yeah, I do that. Make it slightly larger, and then did I make a donut? <laughs> I might have made a donut by accident. Okay. This is the opposite of this, somewhat. Uh, let's try it from the other side. So instead of that, we do this. I wonder what people use this for. Like my voice. Don't know. Don't care. Uh, well, maybe I do care. Maybe they're just gonna defake me and be like, "Hey, you're you're now Hitler for some reason." I am. How did I become Hitler? I don't know. I just became Hitler. Okay. You can tell I'm getting really tired because I don't know what I'm talking about. Let me look at my mirror. Uh, no. Wait. Oh, there we go. It's me. Hi, it's me. <laughs> and I'm gonna grab the water bottle. Gotta stay awake. Gotta stay awake. Gotta entertain the people, the masses. Uh, we'll do just like solid-ish shading, so it's like just just thick shade with solidness of this. Ta-da! Darn. Actually, let me try something. So, pay no attention to the outside, but I'm trying to think. Like, what could I? Could I make this into like planets? See, you know how Jupiter has those bands. So does Saturn. Basically, gas yes, giants in general. So, like, and this is the red spot. No, it, it, like, yeah. Oh, you know what? That's fine. That's fine. So, they, this is the planet. Actually, you know what? Don't do the curves. Do bands like this, so it's like. Mm -hmm. So we got Jupiter now, or a donut that's on the thing, <laughs> its side again. Just it's got this, or that's an eyeball. I don't know. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing now. Uh, this one is just petri dish with bacteria. This is a petri dish, man. This is a face now. This is a face going, uh... Whoa... Whoa... Okay. And this one is a sleepy face. Or, how do you do sleepy face? Like, like this? It's like... Oh... <laughs> yawning. Uh, then I'm gonna do, like... I don't know, hair. So this one's hair. So we got hair. Ta da, hair. This, this thing has hair now. Ooh. And you got eyes. 
in the mouth. I don't know who this, this person is, but now they have hair. They have basically a mohawk because I don't know how to draw a profile here. So they've got a mohawk now. Well, I actually don't know if this, you would call this a mohawk, but um, it's standing on end. Is basically what I'm trying to say. And you got this nose, and they've got a really long nose. Kind of. Okay, they're not that long. They're not Pinocchio, but they've got that. Um... I don't know, it takes something else creative. Uh, if I partition that, and do this partition, then, uh, I don't know, shade this in one way, shade this in another way, doing this, and doing that, and then we got something. I don't know what that is, but well, let me try cross hatching actually. Cross hatching time. I like how this was supposed to be just shading, and I devolved into doing, I don't know what that is, but something. So this one's cross-hatching, I'm going over here. I'm going one way, so this is my hatching. This one hatch. Uh, pay no attention to the lines outside, especially since I can't see, well, down there. And then I'm making the cross-hatch now. Then build it up. Mm -hmm. Then do another cross hatch. We okay. I I don't know. I'm getting kind of tired. I I don't know what to do. Being tired is basically like being drunk. So. So, I don't know. Take with that what you will, I think. Now we'll do, I don't know, this type of shading, which is... I don't know what it's called. What, what was this brush again? Charcoal Soft Rock. Let's do that. Okay. It doesn't give too much freedom, but it's basically like putting down simple... Like, you should do tune shading, but on, like, actual tune thing. It actually does look like tune shading, because it's like, you can see the bands between them. Like I'd probably erase this part and be... Oh, that might actually work. What else? What else is there? Uh, what are these? Blending smear. Oh, I see. Oh. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm shading it via this. This is how I shade now. I shade with uh, smearing, by smearing this. I don't think that's what you, I don't think that's how you do shading, but this is how you do shading now. Or I don't know. Now you have a vortex. A vortex that will go down into I made a galaxy. Wow. Uh what else? Let's just do Actually. No, no, never mind. I'll just do Paint. I'll paint it in. I'll see how this works. Okay, there's that. Uh, okay, painting it, painting. Everything's going fine to some degree. Okay, gotta lighten up on the brush because you're getting to the top. Gotta fill in the white space because I don't know. Okay, I have no idea what 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 happened. What happened to all this? It was going so well. I don't want to control Z because I know what will happen if I do. Because I never lifted the pen, so it'll all be gone. But okay, so you got this. I'll probably just do this, so it's, I'm hiding my mistake, okay, sorry, sorry, I made a mistake, that's, that's how it works, um, so actually, you know what, no, no, this is a cap, this is a cap now, we're, we're discussing, like, a character, like, um, yeah, yeah, so this is a cap now, 
black bean cap. So got eyes, uh, beard. I guess this is a beard now. And this is the hair. And they're looking down. I don't know why they're looking down, but they're looking down. So let's let's have a look at all this. See circles. All the circles that I made with the single use circles and well not single, single stroke circles. Do it in one take. Then you got sketchy circles. Large ones, small ones, uh but they're not really circles anymore. I don't know what what is that even called. Okay, what is that even called? Like ellipsoids or like ovaloids or something like that, I don't know. Like circle y type things. Uh then you got these scrabble circles. It's not scrabble circles. Um, scribble circles, scribble circles. Uh, then went back to uh, the sketches. Then taking taking the I don't know, uh, circle tool, making circles, and then shading them. And this is the shading that happened. Woo! Yeah, this gets weird fast. Got to save because I didn't save this entire time. <laughs> what would have happened if I lost it? I don't know. I'd probably go insane. I don't know how long this has been. It probably has been a while, actually. I don't know. I'll, I'll see it. I'm not going to cut it down because I don't cut things down. I don't edit things because that's not the point. The point is, is that you you got to... That this is me. This is like a diary for me and me only. I don't know who the frick I'm talking to. Um, uh, the, yeah. Liberty... Okay, so yeah, that, that's that's what I'm doing. Wait, how do I end this? I forgot how I ended this. How do I end this? Uh, um, uh, 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 goodbye.